she says it's uh, much nicer here. And when we asked her why, she said it's safe here. There's no shooting here. There's a lot of shooting back home. Good, Now, of course, her main hope is to have legs again and to walk and to go to her mama back home and to show her. So she's telling us what happened. So they were playing and uh, her toy was with her, her teddy bear. And uh, then suddenly a missile came and uh, one of the girls were, was cut in her in two halves and died. And uh, she didn't mention her brother, she's, you know, avoiding the story of her brother getting killed and uh, uh, her legs were cut off immediately uh, on the scene. I know she is under my care and more, no more victims, but in fact I am only helping the people of South Carolina help uh, Sally. It's their kindness that helps me here and gives us hope. We cannot send her to the States without the help of uh, such kind communities in the States. And now I'm teaching her some English so that uh, she can say hello and how are you to them and, and she can communicate and like, now she has hope in life. <laughs> He's crying for hope and happiness more than sadness because now she has a chance maybe to walk or to improve her situation. Uh, he says that this is best, uh, the best thing in the world for him. She says her father is feeling jealous. We joke about her father. He wants to be a prince the same way she's a princess and he wants me to write the same uh, sign for him on his door that he's a prince, but I wouldn't because there's only one princess and that's Sally. <laughs> Sally the that's princess. The